Good day, Stockholm's Bridgetown parents, teachers, and students. Stockholm's Bridgetown TV is with you. Stockholm's Bridgetown consists also of three schools, namely these are the Stockholm's Bridgetown Pre-Primary, Primary, and the Boys High School. The management team of Stockholm's Bridgetown tends to put the most highly qualified person in the hands of your students. This means that the people educating your students not only requires them to be educated in a sense where the knowledge is passed on to them, but also to prepare them to be wise in the future. In a pedagogical sense, different activities by different personnel of each qualified area tend to put them in an area of outside of their comfort zone without violating their personal space and their rights. Stockholm's Bridgetown tends to establish a pedagogical relationship with the students to further elevate the success of their futures. We got academic excellence certificate in last seven years continuously. The first matriculants were, was 2003. That means 19 consecutive years our school got 100% pass rate and mostly very close to 100% bachelor in each and every year. Our learners are participating to each and every kind of Olympiads. Our school is very strong based on mathematics and science, and we got a lot of achievements in national and international levels. Especially, we are organizing Horizon Math Competition. And in last three years, we are making a collaboration with WCED, and the participation number for the Horizon Math Competition in Western Cape increased up to 20 26,000 learners and we are aiming this year to reach 30,000 learners. In National Olympiads we are participating more prestigious mathematics and science Olympiads. One of them is South African Math Olympiads, the other one is South African National Science Olympiads. After the lockdown we, we we studied a lot and harder with our learners and two of our learners are selected for the International Physics Olympiads. For International Chemistry Olympiads, all over the country, four learners are selected and four or four out of four learners selected from our school. This year, another prestigious Science Olympiads results came, SAAS T National Science Olympiad, and our grade 11 learner selected the top learner in grade 11 Life Science and physical science. And also our school selected top school in South Africa in grade 10 physical science and grade 11 top second school in South Africa. And grade four learners, one of the grade four learners, selected the top learner also. She is currently grade five and nine years old. People are asking what is the secret behind of your the achievements and your success? We can say easily, we have really dedicated teachers and they are working really hard. And also collaboration with our with the parents, their support is amazing. Our teachers sacrificing from there with the Saturdays and they are giving extra tuitions for the current learners and also for the Olympiad learners. School is not only for the academic excellence, also, we are paying more attention to sport activities. We have cricket team, we have other soccer teams, under 30, under 12, under 15, and under 18. The learners are supported accordingly, academically, and psychologically. We encourage the learners to participate for the International Olympiads. And our ESCOM Expo learners, they are going to represent South Africa, US, and also different countries from Brazil and Indonesia and Thailand and the Romania. If we look at carefully, we can realize that we are constructing a big family here. The name of the family is the Star Family. Each learner, each parent is a member of this family, and day by day, this family is growing. The learners are finishing grade 12, and they are getting acceptance from the universities. Most of our learners are getting an acceptance in medicine, in pharmacy, and 
engineering area. Generally, at the end of the February, we have open days and we are preparing online open days also. And uh, we are giving scholarship from 5% to 100% for successful learners. And also we are paying attention for the rural area. The good learners are granted by scholarship according to our scholarship exam. We are inviting everyone who is who has the goal to have an excellence in education. Our door is open for the parents and learners whose dream, who wants to realize their dreams in terms of education and sport. has so much to offer learners. Star College Bridgetown is really a hidden gem here in the Bridgetown area. Uh, our facilities are superb in the sense that we have state-of-the-art technology, small classes which allows personal interaction between the teacher and the learner and we really try to live up to our motto which is Ru Akal Bedin which in English actually translates to mind, body and soul. We really try to inculcate not only academic values within our learners but also developing them 
holistically in the sense that they carry on these ethics and values that we start off in the foundation phase up, unto, up into the intermediate phase and then also further on into their high schooling career. At Star College Bridgetown Primary, we have a number of extramural activities that are offered. For this year specifically, we introduced karate, we have sports hub, we have curious cubs which is a science orientated extramural where learners get to do a different science experiment every day which I think is extremely important, especially from such a young age, as we do try to grow our learners with science and mathematic minds from a very, very young age. Star College is unique. Uh, I think the word unique is probably the right, in the right context as well. Because if we should start from the mission and vision statement of our school, that being said, let me put the context for you. A mission and vision statement of Star College states very clearly that it is our ambition to raise the standards of our learners to compete on international level. That being said, recruitment of teachers is so important. Recruitment of learners of all walks of life is so important. Granting opportunities for kids of all walks of life is so important and this is who we are. So if I may start from the top, if you look at our programs that we have in place at the moment, we have teachers, we team up, we go out there, sub-economic areas, and we knock on the doors of our schools and we offer our support in various ways. One, we offer our expertise in mathematics and physical sciences. We offer our expertise in terms of um, supporting socioeconomically, uh, e.g. we have these uh, food drives, blanket drives, clothing drives, and there's so many beautiful things that this institution is doing within these communities. Not only taking these youngsters out of desperate situations and granting them a very sound education, but granting them also a safe haven. Because in our institution, we have 24 hour security, electric fencing, um, we have guards that patrol the perimeter all the time. There is no way a child could feel in this institution um, unsafe. That being said, within the school itself, we have a constitution, a rule of law whereby mutual respect is in place. Children respecting teachers and teachers most importantly respecting pupils and if I may go further, respecting parents. And then I want to touch on the parent component. We are extremely unique in this, at this institution. We have a lot of structure and routine from the time the child walks into the, uh, into the school in the morning. They are escorted by teachers and they are then again at the end of the school day escorted again by teachers. So uh, we offer a lot of security for our learners which I think gives our parents a lot of peace of mind. Our hopes and dreams for 2023 is that our school continues to grow with the success that we have been having uh, in the past years and this can only be possible of course with the, the continued support that we get from our parents. Our parents play a huge role in um, many decisions that we as a school take. We have many fun activities that uh, are planned specifically for the foundation phase. We think that uh, it is important for learners to learn through play and learn through fun activities and in this way they develop a deeper love for learning. So this is something that we strongly try to uh, establish within the foundation phase. Within 12 years, we in the top 10. And the beauty of this 12 years is that this institution was established in a sub-economic area. But since my arrival, I've noticed one thing, that this institution is, is like a diamond. It's lying amongst all this and it shines out. It's made itself heard and noticed in this community. We on the food drives, we are the blanket drives, the clothing drives. We have now even embarked on something very, very different. We go to the local schools and we invite the principals over and we have a, a social afternoon. We have a lunch and we do two days later the secretaries as well. We have programs whereby we go to the local schools and we offer them, e.g. if I may use an example, every Friday we have what we call a hot dog day. So we go out there and we make hot dogs for the kids of our disadvantaged schools. So Star College is just not a, an institution that looks after the few in the class and educate them. No, we look after the community, we look after the children of the community and we've gone one step further. Now, that being said, what else do we do? Question is, where do I stop? We have, we have embarked on so many projects at the school that I've, I feel that um, I think it's time that this school 
to spread its wings. We change mindsets and we change attitudes and we grant you the best education.
wish the best of luck, health, wealth, and everything in between to all members of the Stockbridge Bridgetown. Take care of yourself, stay healthy, and stay safe.